Hey guys, Mosa here, and this is the sports news channel that will give you sports news when it comes out. Now, today's news is Le'Veon Bell signing with the Kansas City Chiefs. Now, let's get started. Let's start off with Bell and Pittsburgh. He had discussions with Pittsburgh trying to get a new contract. James Conner came in, did amazingly, and they didn't want Le'Veon Bell anymore. So they let him go in free agency. He signs a four-year deal with the New York Jets. Adam Gase, the recently signed Jets head coach at the time, decided he didn't want him. He thought that that was a useless signing, in his opinion. And to be honest, getting Le'Veon Bell is not useless. That guy is incredible, even if you use them the way you use them. But I'm just going to say this. Le'Veon Bell, you have to use him in one way. Gase wanted to use him however he wanted and, ru and kind of ruined him eh, a bit. But what we're here to talk about is he had a horrific season his first year with the Jets and now with his second year in the Jets. But this is what happened afterwards. The Jets decided to try and trade him away. No teams wanted to trade for Le'Veon Bell, so they decided a day later, they cut him. They cut him. So we were all thinking, there was three teams he was most likely going to go to, Miami, Buffalo, or Kansas City. He decided to go with the latter. Kansas City Chiefs signed him on a one-year deal, and honestly, it was a good on both sides, as Le'Veon Bell is a very good running back, and the Chiefs now have Clyde Edwards-Hilaire and Le'Veon Bell in the backfield. And honestly, I'm going to just say this. Le'Veon Bell is a very good running back. He's going to get his chance to prove himself and get a larger contract maybe on another team or even with the Chiefs. Like the Chiefs have been signing players left, right, and center, and Le'Veon Bell would be no exception. To be honest, Le'Veon Bell signing is very good for both sides. And... What a coincidence that the Jets will face the Chiefs at one point. That will be a game on Le'Veon's checklist. He will not be playing against Buffalo It's due to the COVID-19 regulations of the NFL. But I'm just going to say this. It's going to be very good for Le'Veon Bell in Kansas City. Now that was it for the news. Tell me what you guys think about Le'Veon Bell signing with the Kansas City Chiefs. Do you think it's something that will be a beneficiary of both the Chiefs and Bell, or if it's not going to work out between either two, do you think he's going to be having 100 yards per game at one point with the Chiefs? Who knows? But what do you guys think about this signing? I want you guys to discuss it in the comments below. Now, like this video if you liked it, hit the notification, and subscribe to this channel if you want more sports news. And I'll see you guys next time. I like her, like her too She my girl, she my boo, she my type She's so cute, I want her and I want her too